Gotta love Step Up because it implies that all of life's problems can be overcome just by simply stepping up. All right, let's go. You got depression? Why don't you dance it out? You, you're unemployed? Why don't you take a salsa class? It's gonna work itself out. Entirely untrue, but a nice thought. I don't know why the guy playing Santa being drunk is such a big deal. But a man's got to do something to keep warm. He's a department store Santa Claus, and he's in his 50s. Of course he's going to be drunk. Shameful. Absolutely shameful. After leaving primetime, Cher made a not-so-easy transition to the big screen. They told her she's never going to be considered a serious actress with the way that she dresses. So what does she do? Shows up dressing like a sexy parakeet. Yeah, you better invite him to Thanksgiving dinner. He's had his hands between your butt cheeks, and now you're just gonna walk away like you don't even know him? Where's your other hand? Between two pillows. Those aren't pillows. Ah! Come on, have a heart. He doesn't have a family, man. It's all so boring here, Margot. If only I could find a real man. Oh, it's so boring. I wish I could find a real man. And then one shows up, and it's Timothy Dalton, and she's like, mm, Can I just hold out for Daniel Craig? Sarah Michelle Gellar is getting her boyfriend out, and then this creepy little bloody corpse thing starts coming down the stairs like the scariest slinky ever. Reaches for the door, out pops another kid. What is this, like a, like a ghost orphanage? You see all of these action guys in it. You got Liam Neeson, you got Andrew Lincoln in it, and they're not kicking ass, but they are getting tail. You know what I'm saying? Getting tail. Paul Newman and Robert Redford. Ooh! I didn't even know this was a Western. I mean, they don't even need to rob banks because they can rob them with their steely blue eyes. I'm glad you brought that up, kid. That's an important topic considering our situation. They give me the money. Sure, you're gorgeous and likable. I love your salad dressing. I keep asking myself why. Did I fail him as a mother? Oh no, he's straying from the formula. He's doing something actually entertaining. And his, his mom reacts like he's in Requiem for a Dream. He's my only son. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. No, don't worry, love, don't worry. He flipped a lady. He, he's not shooting heroin up and then selling himself to pay for the heroin. Take it down a notch, lady. A Christmas Story is my favorite borderline racist holiday film. You When the dogs eat the turkey and they have to go to a Chinese restaurant to eat some duck, uh, the the waiters who are singing to them. You can get away with that back then. You can't get away with that now. They will not make your film if you're like, oh, I, I know what we're going to do. We're going to replace the R's with L's and the L's with R's. America's going to love it. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>